My name is Alex. It's good to meet you, Clea. Can I get a fist bump? Turkey. <laughs> hey, Clea, I'm going to take a guess. All right, Clea? I'm going to say 10 years old. Boom. Right on the money. Right on the money. Okay? Come, some of you aren't impressed. Watch. I'm going to do it again. All right, Clea, I'm going to take another guess. I'm going to say... Uh, girl. Yeah, I got that one right, too. Woo! <laughs> Now, Clea, you and I, we're going to do a cool trick together, all right? So stand front, right here, front and center, face the audience, and make a big T with your body. <laughs> this kid's been searched by the cops before. <laughs> and then next step, Clea, I'm going to have you hold on to these two sharp, sharp sticks, okay? Hold on nice, nice and tight, angle them in towards your eyeballs, and run! <laughs> no, it's a joke, it's a joke. <laughs> <laughs> just out to the side. Hey, Cleo, to make sure we apply to uh, comply with all the rules and regulations, I'm going to hook you up with your very own safety helmet. And Cleo, have you ever gotten a chance to jump around in one of those inflatable bouncy houses before? Yeah, yeah, we take. If you wear this in there, it is way more exciting. <laughs> Now what we're going to do with Kalia, folks, we are going to transform this young woman into a miniature version of the solar system. I am going to spin the earth, bam, on the tip of Kalia's right stick. I'm going to spin the, or uh, left stick. I'm going to spin the planet Mars, boom, on the tip of Kalia's right stick. And I'm going to spin the sun on the top of Kalia's helmet. Once all three celestial bodies are in motion, this audience is going to go crazy. They're gonna clap. They're gonna they're gonna cheer. That woman is gonna throw that little girl high into the air. And why will they clap and cheer, Kalia? Because if they don't, it'll be a bigger buzzkill than when your mom joins Facebook. <laughs> Friend request denied. All right, here we go, Kalia. And I don't know what it is. If it was like the way you were jumping up and down or your awesome outfit, but I have a feeling, Kalia. I put my finger on it. That you are gonna do excellent. <laughs> That's for my generation of people. All right, here we go. Here we go, Clea. Let's see if we can make this work. Nice. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Minor technical difficulty. I got on the wrong playlist magically. My iPod does that. All right, here we go. We're doing it. Here we go. Back on track. from you. I will take that helmet off of your head before somebody confuses you for Lady Gaga. <laughs> and Kalia, for doing such an amazing job, you get a little souvenir from the show, an Alex Zerby professional Zaniac postcard. That is for you. You can have a seat. One more big round of applause for Kalia! Woo! Oh, man. And Kalia, Kalia are, you, uh, is this, are you here with your parents? Where is your, is your, where, where is your dad back here somewhere? Right there. Right over there. Well, Kalia, you did such a perfect job. After the show is all over, your dad is going to give you five dollars. <laughs> it's just a joke, Clea. He's going to give you a twenty. <laughs> now, I've been a professional juggler for a while, you know, and I could certainly come out and do a bunch of flashy tricks for you. Um, but I'm going to cut to the chase and give you the best trick I got. The single most difficult, most challenging trick that I have in my repertoire. And it's a trick that comes in multiple parts. I just have to warm up for a second before I do it. Here we go. Check it out. Amazing. Astounding. Half of the teenagers are texting. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's see if we can pull it off. Like I said, multiple part trick. First part of the trick. Oh, hold on. I'm going to do it the fancy way. Right here. <laughs> 
And being skinny is actually a disadvantage for this part of the trick because I have to balance this club using only one chin. <laughs> and I know I'm skinny too because I was on this game show. The show is called Do You Weigh More Than a Fifth Grader? <laughs> All right, here we go. Second part of the trick. The club goes from the chin to the nose. I hope you're impressed because the trick does not get much better. <laughs> All right, here we go. From the nose to the forehead. From the forehead to the five head. <laughs> and then last part of the trick this is where it's going to get crazy. I'm going to take the club. I'm going to let it fall back behind me. Without looking, I'm going to make a blind kick with the bottom of my foot. The club is going to go flying over my face. It is going to enter that young man. <laughs> and then I'll catch the club and start to juggle. I call this trick Filet of Soul. <laughs> oh, I know, I know. It's not corny, though. It's fishy. All right, here we, All right, here we go. Kicking the club, bottom of the foot. And moving on to some games. Oh, oh, hold on. I totally whiffed. I totally whiffed. Hold on. I hit the thing. Who thinks, quick survey, who thinks I'm going to get it on the next try? Yeah, I mean, I was close. I was close. Who thinks I missed on purpose? And who really just doesn't care? There we go. Nice, nice. <laughs> He's like, I don't care as long as I don't get clocked with one of those things. All right, here we go. Second try. Let's see if I can scale it back or catch it off the net. Woo! Bam! Oh, what now? High five! High five! High five! High five! Crowd surf! <laughs> I'm joking. I only crowd surf when I perform for preschools. <laughs> Why, they're so soft and squishy. <laughs> but... <laughs> 